Hey everyone, in this video tutorial, I'd like to talk a bit about thermodynamics versus kinetics. So now these are two really important ideas that help us to understand a lot of different features about reactions, but sometimes they do get confused and I just wanna tease the two things out. So when we're talking about thermodynamics, one way that people often describe it is it's telling you how far. I like to think about it answering the question, will this reaction happen? Is it likely? One word that's often used is spontaneous. Is this a spontaneous process? Meaning, can I go from these reactants and go to these products? How far will that reaction go? So now, the word spontaneous, though, can cause a little bit of confusion, because when we think about spontaneous, I think we think about spontaneous people, who typically are viewed to make kind of really quick decisions. But spontaneity doesn't tell you about speed at all. It just means, yes, it will happen. So for example, if you think about diamonds, which are a form of carbon, they are spontaneously converting from the diamond form to the graphite form, which is the most stable form of carbon. So now diamonds then aren't forever, but we understand though, as far as kinetics go, they pretty much are because the process, though spontaneous, is very slow. And that's where kinetics come in. So kinetics are telling you how fast. Thermo says, yes, it'll happen, and kinetics will say how fast that process is going to happen. So those are the two main things you wanna understand about them, how fast for kinetics and how far for thermodynamics. And that's pretty much what you need to know.